Well, uh, we've been hunting the wren here, uh, doing the dance, walking around the village, uh, dancing around the village for quite a number of years now. I think for quite a long time there was no dancing done and, uh, and, and now we've got this tradition of just dancing around the streets. Uh, the weather doesn't put us off. Uh, it just gets people together and out. Well, we've come to uh, Skullfurt Le Borough to start to uh, hunt the rain around Port St Mary. We've had uh, the lovely Caroline Helps telling us all what to do and bossing us around and showing us uh, how to do the dance. So we started at the school and then we've moved around the port and we've been dancing in lots of different places around Port St Mary and everybody's been having a wonderful time and the weather's been great for us. We always uh, do this every year, works off a bit of the Christmas dinner and... <laughs> It's all great fun. I think it's always important to carry on doing traditions like this, and this has grown now. I think I counted about 55 people here on that last dance. A few years ago, it was maybe 10, 12 of us. We're coming down, restarting this uh, tradition up, and it's growing every year. We're finding it harder and harder to find spaces to dance. Uh, well, it's a circle dance that involves uh, first ladies go into the circle towards the middle of the circle and the men come out and then they swap over and then turn with the partners and then hand on to someone else. Just the idea of uh, this huge group of people coming together to do Manx dancing and celebrate our culture which doesn't usually happen on any other day so it's just great to see that happen once a year. The more you say it the more bizarre it sounds but it's, it's basically a, a traditional folk dance folk song and it's a tradition which brings the community together and it brings good luck hopefully for the forthcoming year but most of all it brings people together after Christmas and uh, we, we have good fun and we get out in fresh air and we celebrate being Manx. No, I, I, with Caroline Helps, we reintroduced this in we think 1999, we can't be entirely sure and it's gone from strength to strength. So many many years ago there was a, a witch on the Isle of Man had all the men enslaved all the men enslaved, they would follow her anywhere, up the glens, up the mountains, everywhere, and the crops in the fields were dying, and the beasts in the stalls were going unfed, and the women of the island were up in arms about this, that all these men were off chasing tiki tiki. So, they asked Mananin to intervene, and Mananin said, yeah, you know, I think this is, you know, we'll, we'll sort this out. So, there was a huge battle between Tiki Tiki and Mananin, and Mananin won, as was right, and he banished her. He banished her, but she was so upset, and he said, well, okay, you can come back to the island for a morning once a year. You can come back to the island on St Stephen's Day in the morning. But on that day, every man on the island and every wife on the island may raise a stick against you. Mm. So, she, so she comes back once a year on St Stephen's Day in the morning, but she made herself into a tiniest bird that we know, the wren, mm. so she can hide in the bush. So the idea is that we will go out and we will hunt her, and we will put that strumpet to rights. <laughs> and I do it because it's, well, it's community, it's fun, and it's keeping the tradition alive. We're different. We've been hunting the wren, haven't we? Yeah. We've been dancing, yes. I think it's just the camaraderie and keeping the traditions alive is brilliant. Well, I they still did hunt the wren, I wouldn't really like it, but I actually like I find it very fun. Fun? Yeah. Yeah. It just brings everybody together. I do it just simply because I've always enjoyed uh, participating in, you know, the whole uh, culture of the island because, you know, I value it a lot. I think it's very important. What do you think, Emily? Did you enjoy dancing in the middle? Did you yeah. hold the bush? Did you? You held the wren, the bush with the wren in it, didn't you? Yeah. You did, and you enjoy that, don't you? I get tremendous joy from that. I get people turning up who know nothing about it and standing on the outside and saying, what are you doing? And can we join in? And yes, it's, it's fabulous. There are 80 odd people today dancing around in the sunshine on our island. Could be better. Woo!